Okay, welcome to a section 20 where we'll actually be designing a snake ring. So if we have a look at um, the actual ring, uh, which I should have here, uh, we're going to be creating these cobras kind of kissing here. And this is going to be pretty cool. Uh, we've got this piece here in the middle. Uh, we don't need to carry that. We could just have it like this. And we're gonna, I'm going to show you how we can do this and how we can offset all this stuff. We're going to use a ton of different methods in this um, section, section 20. We're going to be looking at creating the base mesh for the snake itself and creating um, the snake. We're also going to be um, UV unwrapping the snake in order to put all these scales on very, very quickly. Uh, and that includes detailing the high base mesh, so the high resolution base mesh. You're going to see here on this slider that it's actually got a low resolution to high resolution. So we can bring that down and you're going to see if I bring it up, we're adding more detail into that mesh. Um, so we have a low resolution version and we're going to be mapping this detail on top of it. So that's a little bit out actually, that's not the final version. Um, so the final version should be around here somewhere. Let me turn that one off. Yeah, it's wrapping in and out, you see. So, uh, and I've got a carrier ring base there, but you could put anything in there you want. And I was thinking about putting some sort of stone in there, but I didn't do that in the end. So uh, this is gonna be like, um, we're gonna actually try and create this snake using a brush. So the main base of it will be done you will it would actually be created by using a um base so, um, a brush base so we'll be using a brush to actually create the base of it and um we can draw that in very quickly we can do one of them and then we can mirror it and offset it so this is very cool um for you guys again look at the course page for the final image of this um and you'll see what we're going to be doing in this course um like i said quite quite involved in the technical side of it we've got a lot of sub tools um, built up in this course you can see i've got like the hoods are all separate and the eyes and the logo on the back um, it is quite involved um, with what we've got going on with this so you can see i can turn some of the fangs off here you know we've got the eyes as separate tools we've got the thing on the back um, this little bit on the back which can be turned off there so there's a lot of different techniques to get this the look of this but looks very good looks very powerful as an image and um, you know opens you up to organic organic sculpting again UV laying out and applying tiling um, snake scales over it and of course hand modeling and also wrapping and bending to get different shapes for rings so this is a very good very powerful um, section of the course this is section 20 of my jewelry design in zbrush course